Okay, you've got uh, dealings with a stranger, somebody that you haven't met before. You've had some kind of incident with them. There's been some kind of mistake or some kind of problem that you had with this person. Something has broken and cannot be fixed right now. Uh, this person is somebody new. Um, whatever this involvement was, it involved some kind of error, some kind of problem. Um, and, you know, this mistake cannot be amended. Now, you want to start something brand new, so you're starting a brand new direction or a brand new... Um, 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 field or going down a new pathway rather <laughs> in life so you want to do something brand new maybe get away from whatever this problem was that you had encountered so in the past you had uh, clarity coming in for you so you had some kind of choice and you started seeing the big picture there was some s sort of scandal some kind of drama some kind of crisis that you had to deal with and that allowed a lot of truth to come in and allowed you to make some kind of dis or it's left you at a point where you have to make a decision now going into the future you've got change so big big things are starting to happen you're starting something brand new with this full card and then you've got that change card coming so big things have happened the old has fallen away this tree is you know shedding its leaves you have made this big change this big transformation and you're moving forward and then you've got that new beginnings card coming so this is almost like the death card you know the end of an old cycle this is like the end of winter um you know uh, or autumn where that cycle ends and you know the, you're you're making these big changes and you're starting off something brand new and you've got two cards of beginnings you've got the new beginnings card and the full card so the full card starting something brand new and the new beginnings card something brand new as well so um you know whatever's been going on with you that cycle is ended uh you know there might have been some kind of problem that you had at work where things didn't work out the way you expected it so there was something that was lost and now you know you've ended that cycle and you're starting off afresh you may be moving to a new job or starting something brand new um you know on a new career path in itself completely so I'm just going to draw some cards from the Tower of New Vision. And you can see the first card is the Fool card. So definitely something brand new beginning for you. The New Beginnings card in the Energy Read and this... So the first card you've got is the uh, Queen of Swords over here. So this is very determined to get things done. So you are starting, uh, you know, this is your, uh, this is uh, the card about making a choice and, you know, going it alone. And you're speaking your truth. You're taking control of that situation and you're moving forward. And you're not letting, any, letting anybody stand in your way. You're very organized. You know exactly what you want. Very clear of thought. Um, and you're being very single-minded about what you want to do. And you're communicating your ideas quite clearly as well. Now, you've got that full card starting off again, taking that risk. There was some kind of drama that happened over here. You've got that volcano in the background over there. And this is jumping off that cliff, taking that chance. You know, what did they say? Taking that leap of faith. Um, so you are making that big move. You know, you are jumping into it. And you've got the Wheel of Fortune coming in over there. So big changes are happening. So this energy is shifting. And you're very determined to get things done your way. So you are not... Um, you know, going to take anything from anybody else. It seems like, you know, the card below it is got, is the devil card over here. So you were dealing with a very, very toxic uh, situation over here. So somebody was, very, you know, being very manipulative of you. You're cutting them out of your life over there and you're moving forward. You're taking that, um, that leap of faith. You're turning your back. You know, it's almost like you're turning your back to the past and you're moving forward. And, you know, although there was drama, you're not really interested in listening to what anybody's got to say. You are making that wheel of fortune change. So big changes coming in for you over there you've got the judgment card over here so this is uh, in this last year you've reached that crossroads in your life and you have made up your mind you've been called to make that decision it looks like that decision has been made because that angel's back is turned and he's moving away so it looks like you have made up your mind about what you want to do and you are moving forward with this judgment card it was a judgment call you made it and you are now moving forward and it looks like you've accepted or you will be accepting this particular offer so some kind of offer came in for you Maybe you didn't want it initially, but it looks like you may be taking this offer up because you've got that full starting brand new again. And whatever this offer was, it's going to allow you a lot more freedom, maybe a lot more travel as well, a lot more air travel, or, you know, and it's going to allow things to start moving. So this new offer that came in, something that you weren't expecting, but that has come in for you and now it's going to allow you to move forward. 
Now, uh, you've got the seven of pentacles. This is on your mind. It seems like whatever you invested in uh, in your work-wise didn't pay off for you. So whatever you were expecting, you didn't get. What you got was very little, and you are not very, very happy about it. So this is probably the reason why you are making that change and moving on. And you've got the world card of here, so the end of an old cycle, so ending that particular job. It didn't pay off. You've got a lot of authority and, uh, you know, you've got a lot of unique skills. So you're turning your back on that particular job and you're moving out, moving away from it. So you're ending that cycle and uh, moving on. And you've got a lot of power in both your hands, so you've got a lot of skills in hands. And you are uh, very unique in your abilities, so you are ending that cycle and moving on. You're going to have to work a, a very, very hard at this particular job. You've got the Knight of Pentacles over here. It was going to be a job about you know being an authority of on in that situation and you, it's going to require a lot of focus but you will be able to sort through it uh, because you're quite a hard worker so you will be able to get this job done uh, you know and it's going to bring in the money uh, even if it's not uh, you know a lot initially but it will bring in success as well then you've got, yeah, there you go. So, you know, even though you're going to have to work pretty hard, there's a lot of success and recognition that will come. And there's a lot of freedom and you'll be doing a lot of travel as well. So, you know, you've gone through a lot of problems, but, you know, you've got a good reputation and people know that you're very good at what you do. And so a lot of commendations come in over there and a lot of freedom to do what you want. Um, and But it's going to take a lot of hard work. But you're, it seems like, you know, you're willing to put that in because with the Knight of Pentacles, it's about being uh, very, very organized and, you know, uh, focused focused on that particular job. So that's what you want. You do want recognition and it looks like you might be working with somebody as well and communicating with a lot of people, but success is coming in uh, over there. And this is what you're aiming towards, some kind of stability, some kind of success. Now, there might be some kind of legal issues that you have to deal with, or you're dealing with a very, very difficult person who stirred up a lot of problems. Now, with the Knight of Swords, it's always about legal issues, uh, and it looks like, you know, whatever news is coming and whatever decision that comes in brings in a lot of drama. You've got things burning up and people running away. So uh, you might be dealing with somebody who stirs up problems or this whatever this decision is or whatever this legal news that comes in, official news that comes in, is not the best of news, but it causes a lot of changes of energy and causes a lot of drama. And ends that old situation. So you could be breaking a contract with the people that you're working with at this particular moment, and that causes a lot of problems, uh, but you are ending the difficulties, and there is celebration and some stability coming in as well. There is success coming in, and the people that you're going to be working with in the future, um, you're ending this old cycle of difficulties, you're starting something brand new, and it's going to bring in a lot of stability and security as well. And they're quite faithful people, and you're going to enjoy working in this new position as well. You've got that King of Swords. So this is waiting for some kind of legal decision. It's a very, very difficult decision. You've got that baby in the background over there, something brand new beginning over here, um, you know, and uh, a difficult decision that needs to be made over here. So whatever this legal uh, issue is, you are waiting for some kind of legal news to come in and it is going to be coming in pretty quickly but it's going to be I think very good news because you've got the Ten of Cups over here following that. So a judgment or decision being made um, and uh, it's going to probably be in your favor whatever this difficult decision is it's going to be in your favor and uh, you know there's some cause for celebration after that decision so if you're waiting for some kind of legal um, news to come in it is coming in the decision will be made and it looks like it will go in your favor as well and it's going to allow you to move forward um, you know with victory so you will start something brand new that wheel of fortune changing um, you know, in your favor, bringing in um, a big change in your life and allowing you to end an old situation as well. So I'm just going to draw, and there's victory. So whatever that legal uh, news is, whatever that legal decision is that's pending, whatever you're waiting for, for, it's going to be in your favor as well. So I'm just going to draw some cards from the uh, Fairy Tarot. You've got the Queen of Summer over here, which says, listen to your heart, intuitive insights that you can trust, taking care of others, uh, perhaps too much. So the Queen of Summer, uh, you know, is the Queen of Cups, um, and this is your card. So the Queen of Cups is your card. Uh, you know, it also shows a, a little bit of loneliness and maybe feeling a little bit depressed. So try and get over those energies. You have the strength to actually deal with it. Um, you know, so try not to be very emotional about whatever happens. You've got the Nine of Winter over here, and this is unfounded fear, uh, focusing on your worst case scenario and allowing worry to grow out of proportion to the problem. So you are very anxious. You're a bit depressed and you're a bit 
bit anxious about what is going on. Then you've got the Princess of Autumn over here that says happy news. So all this worry and distress that you're going through, uh, you need to do that. Just relax because happy news is on its way. And you've got promotions or scholarships or well thought, thought out plans that go perfectly needing a little push to get going. So it looks like, you know, you, you might get back into a, um, you know, some sort of mentoring position or some kind of position that requires further study. But whatever news that is coming in for you is going to be very positive because it's happy news about your career, promotions or scholarships. So whatever is going on for you, it's going to turn around. And, you know, you needn't worry so much or don't be so anxious because you're not getting any sleep because you're staying up a, a, at night. And with this queen of summer, it's showing about, you know, feeling a bit lonely, a bit, feeling a bit depressed. But you've got that six of wands over here. So there's celebration coming in. The princess of autumn says that there's some good news coming in for you and there is going to be success so if you're waiting for some kind of legal decision it's going in your favor because you do have that 10 of cups over here which is about emotional fulfillment getting over problems and um, you know you will be successful the world card is also about achieving whatever you want to so you do have everything in hand and you will be able to achieve those goals that you have set out for yourself this new job that's coming in is going to be something that brings a lot of change and you are going to have to work hard but it's going to bring in that recognition and success that you need so i hope that this reading has resonated with you please don't forget to like share subscribe and don't forget to watch my energy remedy videos that have put out uh thank you for watching take care now goodbye